guys, Jack here from Peach Guitars and today I want to introduce you to one of the newer brands that we've taken on here at the shop. We're going to take a closer look at Mayonnaise Guitars. So before we get too deeply into this today, I want to remind you to subscribe to the Peach Guitars YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. And if you enjoy this video today, please leave us a like and comment down below with your thoughts. And also, if you want to find out any more information about any of the products that I'm going to show you or talk about here in the video today, you can of course find out all the info you want to know by going to peachguitars.com when you finish watching this video. Okay, so Mayonnaise Guitars is a brand that John decided to take on to the shop last year. We saw them first at NAM 2019. Went to visit the guys again at NAMM 2020 this year and have consistently been impressed with their output. And uh, we've just received our second shipment from them, which comprised of eight new guitars. So now that the line's really been fleshed out with what we've got here in stock, and I wanted to take this opportunity to show you some of my personal favorite guitars, including mostly the guitars that came in on this new shipment. But there's one or two here that you're gonna see that we actually received a few months ago as well. So in this video, I'm not gonna dive too deeply into the brand's history or tell you what they're about because the guys actually went to visit the factory and got a factory tour and got a lot of footage from that. So you can see firsthand what the brand is about and how they craft their guitars over in Poland. In this video, I really wanted to, as I just said, pull out a few of my favorite examples of the output that we've seen from them and basically just play them for you and let you see them and you can see and hear just how stunning these guitars are. I will just say that one of my personal favorite things about this brand is just how unique and unapologetic they are. They're making these fantastically crafted, really contemporary modern instruments and they're doing it without any reference to anything that's gone in the past. So they're really quite unique guitars. Unique is a term that is banded about quite a lot in the guitar industry these days, but genuinely I think Mayonnaise have got their own thing going on. You're either going to really like it or maybe not quite understand it, but what's nice is that for 2020 they have actually expanded the range of guitars, including the new Aquilar model that I'm going to talk about in a little bit, so that now there is genuinely something for every kind of player, not just the modern high gainer, you can also get some more classic tones out of that new model too. Okay, so in this video I've pulled out some of my very favorite examples of the Regius and Duvel models. And basically these are the two kind of flagship models, at least to my attention, that have been going for a few years for the Mayonnaise brand now. And basically, as I said, they are just full out, high gain, modern metal machines, in my opinion. But they do actually cover quite a lot of sonic ground. Mayonnaise have really pioneered in recent years the kind of um, attention to detail that's been required for some of the more technically demanding modern artists, such as John Brown, he's on their artist roster. And so any of those kind of players that really want a very precise and highly crafted instrument uh, will really feel at home on a Mayonnaise guitar. Some of the features like the 16 inch radius and the kind of really um, unique wood combinations that you get in these guitars, like using Wenge necks and stuff like that, they just make for very, very playable but very interesting feeling guitars. So chances are you won't have ever played a guitar like this before. It's a very flat, very comfortable neck and it just means that you can absolutely be as precise and as quick as your playing capacity will allow you to be. The instrument is not getting in your way at all. It's really all down to you but you can get the best results if you want to go for that kind of style on these instruments, I think. Now tonally, Mayonnaise always pay attention to using the highest grade of wood and the highest grade of electronics as well. So you're going to see some really interesting wood combinations I've got tons of guitars around me, so I'm not going to delve too deeply into the specs of each one. If you want to find out that information, you can do so on our website. But I will say that they've got great relationships with brands like EMG, Bare Knuckle, and Seymour Duncan in terms of the pickups that they choose for their guitars, and I do believe that they've been working on their own pickup designs as well. So basically you're going to find the very highest grade of boutique quality tone in any one of these guitars. So the other thing that's fantastic about Mayonnaise guitars is that they basically allow you to sculpt any guitar that you can dream up. They've got a fantastic custom shop, again, that you'll see in the factory tour video that the guys shot when they went over to visit the factory. Uh, but just the guitar examples I've picked out for this video today really kind of show you just how diverse their output can be. You've got guitars with fixed Charla bridges like this one. You've also got guitars loaded with tremolo systems. You've got all kinds of clever Ebertune bridges and stuff like that available, again, for the modern kind of technically demanding player. But also, guys that want a little something more classic, you can get something like that in the form of the Aqualar model that I talked about, which I'm going to show you in a second. You've also got a whole wealth of different finish options available too, going all the way up to stuff like this, which is a fantastically picked out Buckeye Burl Maple Top. 
You've also got some really nice gloss and satin finishes. So really, basically, they cover everything. Flat top, bevel top, anything that you want. There's a model that will satisfy your needs. So as I said, the main two models in their electric range are going to be the Regis and the Duvel. And the main defining characteristics between the two is obviously the difference in the body shape. This is a Regis. But also the fact that the Regis has a neck through design. And that goes all the way down to their core classic model, as well as all the way up to these kind of custom models. So it's a really quite expensive feature to have on a standard production model guitar, let alone a custom model like this. The Duvel though is slightly different, as I mentioned, in the fact that it's got a bolt-on neck, which I think actually is no, uh, no detriment to that guitar. It's got a unique quality of tone that you won't get out of a Regius. So basically, if you want a little bit more snap and attack, you'll find the bolt-on design a little bit more favorable, I think. Okay, so compared to what I just showed you with the Regius, the Duvel is a little bit more of a stripped-back model if you want it to be. This is a Duvel Elite, which is available in a six a seven string which is over my shoulder there I believe you can get eight string models as well but we haven't seen any of those just yet but I really like this model this is probably my personal favorite just because as I said in my introduction this brand is unapologetic in what it tries to do and nothing encapsulates that better than the Duvel Elite I think this is just a straight ahead shred machine loaded with EMG pickups one volume and a three-way switch really really fast comfortable neck lightweight body and as you're gonna hear in this clip of this guitar I think it was actually my favourite of the bunch. It's just so direct and so sure of what it's trying to be. And you don't often see that with guitar brands these days. So I really like their mission statement, which is just to simplify things, but make them as best as they possibly can. Okay, so something that's exciting about Mayonnaise guitars is that it's uh, the proof is in this guitar for 2020 that they're not a brand to rest on their laurels. Despite their massive uh, success in recent years with pioneering really modern guitar designs like the Regius and the Duvel, they wanted to turn their attention to something a little bit more classic to kind of um, show a, a wider section of players what they're capable of with the quality of their builds. So this Aquilar model, which is new for 2020, really proves that they're going after a classic S style with an HSS pickup configuration, but they're still employing their gorgeous uh, finishing techniques. So this is one of the quilted maple options. There's also a flame maple option. Uh, so really, really stunning visually as well as tonally. And you've got the really unique combination of the Wenge neck on this guitar as well. Okay, so lest I forget to mention that they do make fantastic bass guitars as well, and we've seen a few of those come into stock, you bass players are gonna be very happy because miners put just as much attention to detail into their basses as they do their electrics. So I think you're gonna find something that's very unique once again in terms of its finish and the way it feels. I really like the way that they design their necks. It actually is quite a unique feel and it's quite narrow at the nut and gets wider as you go up the neck, which is quite unique. Again, I'm not a bass player, but I really enjoy playing these basses. So I hope if you want to find any more info about these basses, you can do so by going to our website. Okay then, so just to wrap up this little introduction video, I just want to say that I'm really excited that this brand is finally making its way into Peach Guitars. And if you want to check out any of the models that we've got, first of all, check out the website, but do yourself a favor and come by the store if you can and check one out. Get it in your hands if you possibly can, because they're just really unique experiences to play these guitars. And I've really enjoyed playing all of these guitars today through the orange rocker verb setup that we got here in the studio. Kind of really exemplifies the great clean tones that you're able to get, as well as, of course, the very modern high gain, very tight and aggressive tones that the brand is known for.
this video as always I hope you've enjoyed it and if you have please do us a favor like the video down below and comment down there too with your thoughts about this fantastic guitar brand if you want to find out any more information about Mayonnaise guitars and basses you can do so at peachguitars.com and you'll be able to purchase any of these fantastic instruments there as well and once you finish watching this video make sure that you check out the factory tour video that the guys shot while they were over there too you'll get a lot more information about the brand and the processes that go into their guitar designs and you'll really get a bit of a better feel what this brand is about. Alright, so thank you so much for watching, stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next video.